Hi, I'm John Henry, the Changeover Wizard at Changeover.com with this month's Changeover Tip from Train Industries. This month's tip is a simple latch or clip with many applications. This example is available commercially from a number of sources and was formerly made by Zeus, which is an excellent source for all types of quarter turn and other fasteners. The latch consists of three parts. A permanently mounted base, a sliding spring clip which is constrained in the base, and a stud mounted to the other component to engage the clip. This is an example of the clip used to attach changeable pusher plates to the push rods on a cartoner. Normally this plate is bolted onto the push rod with one or two bolts, but this takes time and tools to change. There's never enough time, and in some plants, operators may not be permitted to use tools. The latch base is permanently mounted to the pusher plate. The slot in the base of the plate holds it in place laterally. The latch's locking stud extends through the plate and absorbs the pushing force. Lifting force is minimal and is constrained by the clip. To change the pusher plate, the latch is pulled back to release the stud and the plate lifted off vertically. The plate for the next size is dropped in place and the clip pushed forward. Should take an operator about 30 seconds. The icing on the cake is that now there are no loose parts like bolts and washers to get lost. Unfortunately, this clip only seems to be available in one rather small size. There are lots of good applications for it, but some uses might need something heavier duty. Fortunately, it's not hard to make. This is an example of a similar clip on a filler from Fog Manufacturing to hold a bottle size plate in place. The plate is held in place horizontally by two dowel pins permanently fixed in the base plate. The forked clip slides forward to hold it in place vertically. A bolt is tightened to hold the clip in place. This shot shows a detail of the fork clip in the retracted position with the small vertical tab to push and pull it. This is a great design and a real time saver over having to remove multiple bolts. It does still require a tool though. We were brainstorming improvement ideas at this plant during a changeover workshop and came up with a way to eliminate the need for a tool. The bolt is replaced with a shoulder bolt permanently fixed in the base plate that allows the clip to slide in and out. A spring-loaded ball screw is mounted inside the size plate and a corresponding groove machined in the clip. When the clip is pushed forward to lock the plate down, the ball engages the groove and locks it in place. When the machine is running, centrifugal force pushes the clip forward so the force required of the ball lock is minimal. Reducing change over time and eliminating tools? What's not to like? With over 8,000 machines in inventory, it's hard not to find something to like at Frayne. You need it, they've got it. More importantly, they have it fast and for purchase or short-term rental. Visit their plant in Carroll Stream, Illinois, minutes from O'Hare Airport, or visit them online at www.framegroup.com. I'm John Henry, and I'll see you next month with another changeover tip. Thanks for watching.